Archer was one of my first big marks. He was huge in advertising and he wanted a pretty, much, much younger looking woman on his arm. And you got him to marry you? I was his trophy wife. I, I wasn't his first, and I'm sure I certainly wasn't his last. Okay, so if Shiloh was Archer's son, you, you must have met him. I mean, do you remember anything about the guy? No, I, I don't remember meeting him. He didn't go to the wedding? No, I think he refused on the grounds that his father was marrying a gold-digging tramp who was taking his inheritance, which wasn't entirely wrong. And Archer must have talked about him. His father called him David, so him going by Hank, I think, was his way of rebelling, and I got the impression that he was probably living off of his trust fund. Okay, even if you never met face to face, Archer's son must have known about you, seen a picture. I mean, wouldn't he have recognized me today? Maybe he was waiting to see if you would recognize him. Or, or Shiloh, or whoever he is, made no attempt to hide his personal history on the Dawn of Day website. Come here, look, it, it reads, Growing up in the insulated and hedonistic world and extreme wealth was the chief motivator behind Shiloh's decision to reinvent himself to create a more meaningful, welcoming community. All these buzzwords, it just seems like he's full of crap. There's too many coincidences. I mean, your history with Shiloh, Shiloh's connection to Drew, and first Oscar, Liz with him, and now Christina. Too many people we care about are in this guy's orbit. Who we have so far? Mm -hmm. Let's start with Oscar. Okay. Who is your nephew? Okay. So we'll put Jason, you know, down there, and then we go with Drew, because he's your brother. Drew saved Hank slash Shiloh, so we'll put him here. Who is the son of my old Mark, Henry Archer, who is now living with my sister, Christina. Who's in the middle? You. And who am I? Linda Black. <sighs> Black. First Christina starts hanging out with these Donna Day people. The next thing I know, I'm getting emails from somebody using my old alias. It's not a coincidence. No, Jason, it's not. Not by a long shot, but I am right here in the bullseye.